What up, friends and fam? I'm super excited because I have a massive box of vintage home decor. I don't know what's inside. And we're gonna do a mystery box unboxing of vintage home decor. What's up everybody, if you're new here, my name is Vaina, I'm an interior designer. And I just moved into a new apartment in Dallas. I've been here for about a month. Um, and so my mama was like, I want to send you a box, a mystery box of home decor. It just arrived. So we're going to open it. Okay. For the first time here on camera. All right. Oh my God. I'm so excited. How am I going to do this? Okay. Oh, hello, gorgeous. Hope you have fun unboxing a vintage surprise box. Thank you, mama. I love it. Okay. So my mom, just to give you context, my mom is literally the garage sale queen. She finds everything for like 50 cents, honestly. I pay full price, no discount ever. She's like the one that you go to for stuff. If you say you're looking for something, she finds it and she finds it cheap. So she is modern eclectic boho. If you take my style quiz, you would know what that is. I am gla eclectic glam slash Parisian. We have different styles. So let's see what she got me and what I'm gonna like and what I'm not gonna like. Ooh, I hope I like stuff. Wow, it's literally jam-packed. Opening up package number one. This actually reminds me of the time when I asked her to send these mid-century dishes from my grandmother's antique shop to me for my birthday. And they arrived on my birthday and they were all broken because she packed them with paper towels. And I was like devastated and angered. I just have never gotten over that. Anyway, ooh, okay. Two things, shell porcelain tray with a gold rim gold trim rim this is actually super popular right now anything shell is really really in this is beautiful i love it a little bit of pink jewelry and stuff honestly i don't know if i see myself wearing them but let's see okay because everybody knows that i love pink so these are oh they're actually pink stone earrings kind of retro i don't know what do you guys think they're cute they're cute okay i forgot she's gonna be watching these and then some other things. Okay, I'm definitely not gonna be wearing these. <laughs> I'm not gonna be wearing these. But they are fun and I can see why she sent them. Okay, that's interesting. A piece of wood with an organic shape. Okay, styling guys. I have to style mantles. I have this like weird little niche in my hallway. As I go through this guys, Please comment and let me know what you love. And if you don't love anything, you can say that too. This is one thing that I did see before and it was just so ironic. She, I was, she sent them to me. So this is a mauve colored melamine set of dishes. And the reason she sent them to me is because they are from Dallas, Texas, which is where I'm currently, the color is gorgeous, okay? Now I think that like eating off of plastic is kind of disgusting, but glamping guys, picnics, barbecues, music festivals, outdoor. Ugh, it's a set of four. This is the only thing I actually do know. She packed them really, really well too, I have to say. I'm trying to do this fast. Okay, here we go. It's called Texas Wear. This is cool. These are super collectible, like on Etsy and stuff. So it's a set of four large plates. And on the back it says Texas Wear, made in Dallas, Texas, which so they are returning to their homeland. Super, super pretty color, which will be tying into some of my home ideas. Four little salad plates. These are cool. This is like something I see on Etsy. So there's, oh, and they're slightly dis different colors though. So the plates are like a little bit lighter and then the cups are more saturated, but they all go together. They're fun. What do y'all think? Y'all like them? Do y'all like it? Okay, and this just was here. Okay, so I don't know what this is, but I know, I think actually it's a hot plate. I know why she sent this to me because I need warm woods in my kitchen. I actually do like that. This is the color that I need. And actually, kind of looks good together. Okay. 
Okay, this is something, this is interesting. There must be a set to this. Okay, so this is a like a mid-century made in the USA tray. And I think it has, it must have like a bowl here. I think it's like a cheese board or something. Sorry, I don't know all of my like vintage language. I bet you the other parts of this are in this box. Okay. Now she knows that I need wood stuff because, ooh, I don't know what that is. That's heavy, but I'm excited about it. Okay, looks like. Ooh, okay. It's hard to get this stuff out. Okay. A couple of the places that I wanna style in my home are like the fireplace. That's like gonna be a whole video, a whole vibe. Um, ooh, ooh, big pillar candle holder, white. That's definitely useful. Maybe I can use this on my fireplace. I actually really like this. Okay, this looks like something glass. I need more stuff because I'm this background is not that great for YouTube. I get it, but please give me grace. It takes a while to fully furnish your a new home when you don't have a lot of stuff. Okay. Ooh, vintage hobnail glass vessel. Okay. And I know exactly where I'm going to use this. I have that little niche right there you can see. And I want to put dried flower arrangement in there. And it's like kind of a place where I put my like keys and little things like that. And it, it's a kind of a tall niche. So this vessel is the perfect thing for these dried flower arrangements. And it is a very Parisian. Okay. Ooh, oh my God, I need this. I think this is perfect. Okay, I was, this, ah. Cause I need something either above my stove or above my sink. And I didn't want it very large because I don't want to reflect like dirty dishes in the sink. So this is fantastic. And you know what? It's a warm, it's like a brushed gold color. It's not like, I can't talk. Okay, you guys can just see it. Oh my goodness. She knows me so well. This is very chic. Maxim's Paris. It's a beautiful little tray that's very French. And it's vintage and it's Maxim's. I don't know what Maxim's is, but I love it. This is a, I love these little dishes for putting like your watch or your earrings, your little pearl earrings, which I always wear. Super cute, super chic. Love, 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 love. Thank you. All right, we've got maybe one, two, three, four, four more things in here. I don't know if I love, but I'm actually doing, actually I do love it. I am doing more saturated colors. I'm trying to introduce more masculine into my home. And this is actually pretty cool. It's got the little wicker trim, little three taper candle holder. I'm sure we can find a place for this. I love it. It's in here. So fun. If anybody wants to send me boxes, or gifts, let me know in the comments below. Just kidding. Ooh, I love it. What is this? Oh, this is a heart. This is a tearjerker, y'all. Daughters and mothers, a tiny book. How cute is that? Oh, mm, a celebration of daughters and mothers by Lauren Cohen and Jane Wexler. How cute. That's very, that's very cute. And it's a bunch of different daughters and mothers together in a tiny little book. That's amazing. Thank you. This is great because I need more hooks in my life. How sweet is this in a bathroom? It's a lady taking a bath. That is so cute. And actually after I finish my kitchen, I need to start working on my closets, which are atrocious. I'm a hat wearer. I need a bunch of hooks to hang up my hats. Okay, so here's the other four melamine mugs and something else inside. I love this color, guys. Are you into this? I'm super into this. So cute. And I think they're dishwasher safe, which is amazing because I have a dishwasher. Ooh, another vessel. Okay, I love this. Beautiful milk glass vessel. Okay, this is something I actually kind of saw before. I'm not gonna lie. Salt and pepper shakers, vintage. Not sure it's totally me, but I I need warmth. I need warmth. 
These are kind of fun. I don't know if I've used them, but I kind of like them. I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Okay, so, ooh, ooh, it's just keeping me surprised. Ooh, ah, I'm liking it even more as far as I go. Okay. Ooh. All right. Okay, I recognize this from my room when I was staying with my parents recently. This is a little ring dish, a little donkey ring dish. How cute is that? And then this is beautiful. Okay, a gold goblet. Hello, fit for a queen. That is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. That, that we're gonna combine. I don't know how we're gonna do it, but we're going to combine beautiful things and special moments in my home. I love this. This is so good. And then this is so good too. This is the last piece. This is gorgeous, gorgeous. I might try, this could so many, oh my God, this could go so many places. I love this finish of brass, solid brass, ow. Gatco solid brass made in India. This is really beautiful. I would love to see a light and airy fern inside. If you can, I'll have to ask her. She's like a master gardener. Gorgeous, let's see if this will fit in my kitchen or whatever, I'm in love. Oh my God, there's one more. Oh. Okay, I have to like not have this video go for so, so long. You guys, don't forget to subscribe as well. I usually edit the heck out of my videos and this one, I'm just going for it. So please let me know if you like this style. Wow, there's actually a lot more. Okay, we're at 17 minutes, it's so long. Okay, oh, blue white china. Oh, this is really, really pretty. These are special. These are so special together a little pear, which is so important to bring pears into my life. Love. Oh, this pear is having a child because there's another member of the family that just arrived. Soup's cute. Soup's cute. Little butt vase vases. Wow, super, super sweet. All three different shapes. These are, I love these. They're so sweet. Yes, yes, yes. Don't love those colors. Okay, so if you guys recently saw my viral decorating trends video, you know that twisted candles was, some, was one of the trends and I needed some tapered candles to be able to try this trend. And I'm living for these colors. I'm actually living for these colors. Terracotta, aqua blue, and ivory. These look amazing. Um, the red, this red is good. Okay, we might practice with these. So that looks like everything, guys. What do you think? What was your favorite? Let me know. I'm gonna insert a screenshot of everything so you can kind of take inventory and decide what you loved, and if you didn't love anything. Thank you so much, mom. I really appreciate it. I cannot wait to style these. I will be sending you a million texts. And thank you guys so much for joining me on this video. Please subscribe. I'm trying to get to 100,000 subscribers by the end of May, my birthday. But thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.